Hello chaps, Wolfgore here, and welcome back to Bloodborne, episode number 30. 30 episodes in. Good stuff, good stuff. Alright, so in the last episode, what did we do? We took care of the old mother brain. Okay, dude, fuck you. Fuck you, for real. Uh, we took care of the mother brain, got our blood rock, leveled our Ludwig up to 10, just cleared up most of the... Most of the castle. Now we're just gonna finish up the last leg of it and go fight the wet nurse. Quicksilver bullets. Fuck you, buddy. Nope. Fall off the ledge. I'm coming for ya. Oops. Up a miss. Take my blood vials, and my blood bullets, and we missed all the loot in this room last episode. We just ran through and did the piggies, just to show you guys how to do the, uh, the farming route. Ah, no piggies, that makes this really convenient. More blood vials. Anything over here? Nah. And what is this? Oh, we got a gem. That actually looks pretty big. Nourishing. Oh, we get a nice 15% physical. That is really good. Better than the 12.5% one. So the one we do have on right now also has uh, recovery on it, but. I'd probably rather just have the bonus to physical. 2.5% doesn't sound like much, but those multipliers really stack up. Oop, that's a wall. Come forward a little, please. There we go. I know how to parry shades. Blame me for looking, that is a pretty beautiful view. Whoa, the moon is big. Damn. How high up is this castle? Jesus. Um, I want to say there's a skitterer down here. And I am correct. Hey, buddy. I have killed all of your brethren, every last one. And now you too can join them. We got three more chunks there. And I want to say this just loops back to that weird little drainage thing at the start. Yes. Oh, guys, we're so close to the end. We're so close. I don't know how to feel about it. I think we're going to do the DLC. I'm having too much fun with this series. I don't want to stop. Yeah, we're gonna do the DLC. All right. Got it. Got it. Got it. Oh, can you tell I fought these guys a few times? There we go. Heal up then loot so I stay full on my blood vials. Yeah, you suck. Lots of blood vials. Alright, so... Is there anything else? Uh, we got the Queen of Yarnum right here. Um, if you attack her, she just disappears. Nothing too fancy about that. Uh, this is... 
I've never understood why this is here, but there's just an extra Efesca's blood. Uh, Efesca being the, uh, the doctor from the clinic. And, well, you know, I don't really see the point in not attacking you, let me put it that way. She dropped something. Uh, you do actually fight the uh, the Queen of Yarnum in one of the very last Chalice dungeons. Pretty epic boss fight. Feels like a raid boss. All right, and now we have Margot's Wet Nurse. This is a good fight. I always really enjoy it. That's intimidating. All right, so let's just go ahead and buff up. I'm gonna go big Ludwig for this, I think. Good attack. Unfortunately for you, I know how to dodge it. Can you do that? Hey, give me my health back. Right in the safe pocket, and they're back. Uh, I feel like that should have hit. Health back. Stop doing that. Top it off, get in the safe pocket. And charge power R2. Yes. Let's get one more. Oh, nice. Oh, and now her friend is here. Um, so in this fight, if you're having trouble. A totally valid strategy is when it goes all dark like this, just sprint around the room in a big circle. You'll be totally fine. The occasional roll, but yeah, totally fine. But at the same time, you can fight. You can't fight, you just have to fight too. So I'm gonna try to do that, because I ain't no bitch. Oh, mistakes were made! Mistakes were made! Well. God damn it. All right, uh, let's just cut back. Alrighty, chaps, we are back for round number two. But I want these echoes. All right. We're gonna play it a little smarter this time. I'm not gonna try and show off during the hard phase. Ow. Let's get a little health back. Back it all up and heal. And, oh! That's an attack that hurts. That's an attack that hurts. Alright. I want to get behind her. Oh, shit! We're already doing that? Alright. There's your friend. There's your friend! Woo! Alright. So I'm just gonna... I'm not gonna show off. I'm just gonna run. I'm just gonna win the win the boss fight. One little roll. And look how easy this is. You can't hit shit. You can't hit shit. <laughs> Done with this yet? Yes. Ah. All right. So uh, that's that's the strat there. Pretty pretty fucking effective if you ask me. Ooh, good dodge. Darn it! Look at that range.
<laughs> no one always misses. I should stop trying. Oh, where'd you go? What are you doing? Come back here. This is going well. Quite well indeed. Just get to the safe pocket. And one power R2 should finish this on up. Whoo! Wet nurse down. Feels good. Feels good, chaps. Feels good. Woohoo! Victory spin. Stop crying. Can I... Can I finish the boss fight? There we go. Nightmare slain. And an additional one-third of an umbilical cord. Oops. We totally forgot to check in on Ariana. I hope... Hope it's not too late. Uh, let's go do that real quick. All right, chaps, so we are back in Cathedral Ward. Everyone we have come to know here is dead, except for Ariana, last we checked. She was sitting in this chair. She was not feeling very well. And based on the knowledge we gathered from uh, checking in on Efesca, or the Efesca imposter, we know that she's uh, probably pregnant with, like, an old god baby. It's pretty dark and twisted, and now there's a trail of blood leading down this way. I always want to save her, but she can't. So let's just follow this. Take the ladder down. We got some insight. We're up to 99. Oh god, it's so disturbing. You okay? It can't be. This is a nightmare. Seriously. Okay, so you're just hysterical. No, that makes sense. Right. Oops, shit, I'm sorry, I didn't, I didn't, oh, I just wanted to hit the little thing, not you. Well, that's how you get the last umbilical cord, and Ariana's shoes if you want them. Damn it, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, girl. At least you're out of your misery. Probably not not a whole lot left to live for in this world. Well, <laughs> yeah, so that's a, the, the very dark end of that quest line. Um, let's head back to town. All right, chaps, we are back in town in the hunter's dream. Uh, not looking too good. Got a little, uh, little fire situation going on. Let's see what a doll has to say. You have come. Yep. I'm here. The dawn will soon break. This night and, and this dream will end. end. Really? Gammon awaits you at the foot of the great tree. Good to know. So. Very Channel good. Blood Echoes. Mm, strength at 30 is good. I'm going to start, start putting points into skill. Farewell. And what we have over here... Right over here through this gate... Is the last boss, and the hidden last boss. And we have everything we need to do them both. But... But I think we are going to be doing the DLC. And if we go do them... Once we finish it, we'll be put into New Game Plus, and we won't get to do the DLC. So we're going to do that first. We're going to do that first. I know, I know. I want to do it right now too, but what can you do? Let's level up one more time. That's what we can do. Oops. 
Gammon away. Very open. And it's uh, worth noting that even when this place is on fire, everything else still functions the same. It's perfectly fine to get up to the Gehrman boss fight and then just leave everything ablaze. Alright, so I want that blood gem. 15%, very nice. Mm. Can we buy blood rocks yet? Because we are sitting on 99 insight and I would love to get rid of it. Yes, we can. Alright, our first blood rock. For 60. Now we can get a second item up to plus 10, and we'll be probably be doing that during the DLC at some point. I probably need vials. Alright, so we have a little time left in this episode. And with that time, we are going to go initiate the DLC. To do that, we go to Cathedral Ward, and we already have the Eye of the Blood Drunk Hunter. All right, so here we are in Cathedral Ward. We have the Eye of the Blood Hunt, dr the Eye of the Blood Drunk Hunter. That's a hard one to say, uh, which we got from killing Vicar Amelia much earlier in the Let's Play. And with that, if we are grabbed by this chap right here, we're going to be taken off to the DLC. Where's, where's the spot? Where's the place? Where do I go? Did you just grab me? Oh, I hear you doing it. Where's your hand? Oh, okay, you still grab over there by the hunter's hat. No. Yeah, I don't think it's any coincidence that uh, the uh, the key to the DLC is right where you get the top hat. That looked painful. Curse the fiends. They're children. And here we are. Look familiar? Well, it's all gonna look familiar. Because it's set in the past in the same area. Got a locked door to the right. And we're definitely gonna need to wrap up this episode, but I just wanna get outside and kill one thing. Oh look, a fellow hunter. Hi, are you friendly? Oh, good attack, you just killed those. We're both hunters, what's the problem? Sherman. Hyper frames, bitch. Sit down. Some blood vials. Ooh, ooh. Let's look at those blood gems, those are big. Oh, 8.1, 12 points, no. Eh, okay, they suck. They suck. They just look like they might be good. Alright guys, so here we are in the DLC. Um, it's actually a really big DLC. Uh, almost as big as the original game. So, uh, we're gonna start chipping away at this next episode, episode 31. And we're gonna have to wait until the end to do the, uh, the Garman fight and the hidden last boss. But, it'll be worth it, the DLC is super cool. But I want to thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you next time. Peace.